Hello, in this video will introduce you to just some of the concepts related to golf's ball flight, but will hopefully pique your interest enough to check out the full detailed video currently being put together by uh, Mr. John Graham, PGA of America member from Rochester, New York, and myself, Mark Strong from the PGA of Canada here in Vancouver, BC. It seems as though the D-plane, which is a term coined by Ted Jorgensen in his book, The Physics of Golf, uh, continues to be misunderstood. I think this is largely due to the explanations out there lacking in an easy to visualize representation. Uh, hopefully that's what this 3D kind of drawing we're going to look at now helps represent that uh, people can, can visualize what's actually going on a little easier than, uh, than just some of the explanations or two dimensional pictures out there. Uh, as you see, we do have our D plane here. We also have what we call the impact plane. I'm going to use that term instead of swing plane, which is uh, commonly used by the, the Doppler radar launch monitors out there. This view here would be directly from behind the golfer and the, and the ball looking down the target line. This view here would be directly from overhead. Again, our target line going up this way. And the view we've got right now would be at about ground level looking face on so that you would see the, uh, the front of the player and the target line going down this way. Uh, so to start off the impact plane or swing plane really just serves to help determine the 3D path, um, which is this pink line down here. That's the direction that the club head or the, the center of gravity of the club head is moving at impact. And that's <clears throat> important. That's the, the first edge or vector of our D plane, as you can see. The second edge or vector of our D-plane is the club face up here, so this blue line. Um, you put the two of them together and we, we get our D-plane. From this D-plane, uh, we can learn a lot of other stuff about what the, the golf shot will do, the direction it will launch, as we can kind of roughly see here, how it spins, um, how much side spin that would relate to. If we assume center contact, meaning the, the shot was hit on the sweet spot, this D-plane will tell us uh, exactly what the golf ball will do when it first launches, how it's going to spin, everything we need to know. Um, pretty valuable information if you are either looking at it from a playing perspective or a teaching perspective. Um, the full video is going to go into much more detail about uh, all the information you can see on the side here regarding the, the D-plane, the impact plane, the behavior of the golf ball. To get more information about the upcoming video and its release, you can follow me at Stronger Golf on Twitter or at John Graham Golf. Uh, alternatively, you can go to either of our websites, www.strongergolf.com or www.johngrahamgolf.com and get full release information. Thanks very much for watching and feel free to contact either of us if you do have any questions in the meantime.